to your dentist every month. Like they have their yes. monthly checkup, right? Okay. Yeah. Especially, especially if they have uh, braces. Yes. Okay. So you have a you have a flexible time. Yes. It's not okay. um, flexible, but I I choose a day, one day and one week. I just have a day off in a week. Ah, oh, okay. So it's still yes. not flexible for you. Yes. Okay. All right. So how many clinics do you have? I mean, how many clinics do you go to? Because some dentists have to go to two dent dentists or then the what I the know clinic, that. right? I, yes, I know what you mean. I have some friends. Mm -hmm. um, they work for maybe three of maybe four dental clinic uh, at uh, uh, Monday, Wednesday, or uh, Thursday maybe mm -hmm. uh, and. Um, or maybe on the uh, on the day and at um, maybe uh, out of the um, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean that um, uh, maybe in a day they would uh, they work for one dental clinic and at night they they work for another. Some, some, I have some friend like this. Yeah, but I just, but I just one. I just have one dental clinic as a look for here because uh, I um, want to use my another time for my kid. I um, mm. yes, after working, after a long working day, uh, I just have maybe just, uh, four to five hours at night to play and to mm. learn with my daughter. So. I don't want to go to work more. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's right. Okay, so you are full time, right? You're full time in your clinic. Yeah. Okay, yeah. that's great. Okay, so now thank you for sharing those. Uh, what about our homework? Uh, did I give you homework last time? Yes, I am. I'm so sorry for this, but I I had to. I'm, I had to not finish the homework. <laughs> I will send you uh -huh. later. Uh, yeah. Yes, okay. So I told you to choose five words from the vocabulary. Uh, you yeah. have learned, okay? Then use them in sentences. Okay, so yeah. it's okay, all right? You can send me yeah. when you have By the way, you look, okay. uh, more, Let's have you look more beautiful before. when uh, you're not tired of hair. Oh, really? oh, thank you so much. Oh, I've got long hair before. Okay, I've yeah. got long hair. Yeah. But uh, it's too hot. Okay, it's too hot in my country, so I have haircut. Okay. Um, yes. Okay. Thank. You. Yeah. Thank you so much, Miss And you look more beautiful too when you are wearing your uniform. Yes. Thank you. Okay. But it's okay. So you're very pretty, especially your especially your teeth. I love your teeth. Oh yes, I I, I make an orthodontic treatment for me by wearing Invisalign. Oh. You know that? Yes. Okay. Um, what do you call? Oh, can you type the name of it? Yeah. I forgot the name of it. Yes. Yeah. This is a, a tray. Um, maybe you know that because it's so famous in That's the, name. the world. Yes. Oh, how do you read this? Invisalign. Invisalign? Invisalign. Yes, Invisalign. Oh. Oh, in my country, we have the word uh, veneers. Are you familiar with veneers? Yes, veneer is a, a, um, a thin layer of the, of the porcelain teeth. They, they close on the side of the teeth to fix the shape, oh, the so color. 
it, it oh, which is better? Is, yes. We have veneer. We also have veneer in a, it, it's also very famous now. It's very popular now in Vietnam. Invisalign. Uh -huh, but which is better charity. for you? Yes. Oh, hello. Can you hear me? <laughs> Okay, okay. Okay. Yeah. I, so I think I think um, Invisalign is a beautiful one because it looks good on you, right? Your yeah. smile is very beautiful because of the teeth, right? <laughs> I Thank like you. it. <laughs> okay. I'm planning to right. I'm planning to, but I think uh, braces first, right? Braces, and then maybe. If I have a lot of money, yes. <laughs> I will, yes. I will have that. Braces. Braces. I have uh, maybe 800 person who is who are wear, wearing braces now. Oh, you have beneficiaries. Huh? <laughs> you have beneficiaries. So they come, they come to your clinic every month. Yes, mm. my team had three doctors and four staff for nurses. For nurses, so we uh, we have maybe more than eight hundred patients. Wow. Okay, that's why you're busy. Right? <laughs> you're busy, yeah. so you don't need to you don't need to go to another clinic because you will not yeah. have time for your family. Yeah. Okay. All right, thank you so much, Ms. Um, Zhang, for sharing Invisalign. <laughs> yes. Is it expensive? Is it yes, expensive in your country? Yes, it is the most expensive uh, type of orthodontics. Yeah. Wow. Maybe the cost, okay. maybe they have three or, three or four um, in compare for time in compare with braces. I oh. mean that with braces in, in my in my country, braces just cost maybe thirty million thirty million for one case. But in visualize oh. maybe uh, uh, from ninety to one hundred and twenty uh, for each case. Wow, okay, but it's yeah. really beautiful, right? It's worth it. Yeah, it's, um, it's um, aesthetic. We can remove it when you eat or when you brush the teeth, you just can remove it out. Now I, I'm going to remove it. Oh. I'm not oh, wearing really? it now. Yeah. Oh but, oh, but you still have beautiful teeth. Okay, even if you're yes. not wearing it. It's, be it's yeah, still beautiful. That is that is my natural teeth. I just think that's it. Oh, really? I, uh, I just realized by uh, Invisalign. My oh. estate. Yeah. Yes. Oh, so how yeah. long, okay, how long have you been using Invisalign? How long? Maybe one year, one year and six months. I, have, oh, I, will, wow. I will finish my treatment in in three next months oh so you have to wear it for more uh, for three months more no uh, i have to wear it 20 to 22 okay. hours a day ah oh, okay so that yeah. would be the rule for it okay but yeah. i think invisalign is more comfortable i think invisalign is more comfortable than braces right yeah. Okay. Oh, so we will we will talk more about your job. Okay. Next yes. meeting. Okay. Yes. So I am learning a lot from you. Okay. So let's move on to this word. Okay. Let's practice first. Uh, please yes. read the word uh, reliable. Reliable. Um. Number two. Yes. The number two in unsuccessful. Unsuccessful. Mm -hmm. Number three, three is so we, so we. 
uh, with the same meaning with mm -hmm. autumn, autumn station. Yes, okay. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Ostentatious. Wow, you remember the yeah. meaning or the, the yeah. synonyms. Oh, what about positive? Yes. Positive. Positive with um, favorable. Okay, that's right. Costly. <laughs> yes. yes. Costly had the same meaning with expensive. Okay, and wow, you have reviewed our lesson, right? Yes. <laughs> oh, and uh, I got it from you. So, <laughs> yeah, luckily, so lucky I remember it. <laughs> Yeah, because um, okay. some of my students, okay, some of my students don't remember the lesson. Okay, they yeah. So I'm very happy that you remember. Yeah. Okay. Mistrustful so next one, mistrustful. Yes. Yes, mistrustful wow. had the same meaning. Oh, hello. With, yeah. Uh, okay. So mistrust. Yes. Uh, mistrustful had the same meaning with suspicious. 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 Mm -hmm. That's true. Yeah, suspicious. Yeah, suspicious. 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 Okay. It's correct. Yeah, seven practical with had the same meaning with um uh functional functional. Okay, that's right. Yes, it's complicated with complex and. Mm -hmm. I remember the night because you say I make it I, I did it wrong last time. Simple with <laughs> modest. That's right. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. Okay. Ten. Next effective. Effective, effective with uh, had the same meaning with successful. Okay, yeah, that's right. Successful. Yeah. Next, overconfident. Yes. Yes. Overconfident. Overconfident. I know that. Arrogant, arrogant. That's right. Yeah, I told you, right? I told you last yeah, time the meaning you, of yeah, arrogant. You know, I remember it. <laughs> That's right. Okay, next. Self, self culture had the same meaning with worry. Uh, this one is positive. Yeah, worry. At last time, I think it's passive. But now I know uh -huh. it. Uh, yes, that's right. Okay, so yes. cautious means uh, being careful. You are careful. Yes. careful. Okay, so meaning uh, Yeah, that's right. So Miss Zhang, okay, for example, uh, when you have a patient, you need to be cautious. Yes. Okay, because it's very um, important. Okay, or dangerous if you do something uh, wrong, right? Yes. Each person we have to have, like, um, we have to check carefully everything that they have, every every every, pro every problem okay. that they oh, have. So, um, yeah. mm -hmm. yeah. That's right. So being a dentist is not an easy job. Like being a doctor also, because if you did something wrong, okay, you. Yeah. Uh, rem or they will remove you from being a dentist, or you will lose yes. or lose your license. Right? Yes. Okay. Next one, Miss Zhang, number eight. Uh, which of okay, which of the adjectives in seven are positive? Yes. Okay. And mm -hmm. which are negative? And then I want you to explain your answer. Okay, yes. so we have here seven and eight. Yes. Okay, wait for a moment. Oh, here. Yes. You turn to the next slide. Okay. okay so to, now? choose, all right, which are okay. positive. Yeah, positive and negative. Positive and negative, yes. Um, I think in those words, uh, the word had the positive meaning is uh, reliable. Uh, positive. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I I um I consider the the word costly, but I think it's still positive. And uh, practical. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Practical. 
for uh, the number four positive and oh, the number four. five. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Positive. Ghostly is positive. Okay. Next. Okay. Uh, simple. Effective. Oh, yes, that's right. Simple. And cautious. Cautious. Okay. Very yeah, good. Oh, what about a negative? Get it. I think that uh, unsuccessful, misjudgment, okay. mm, complicated, mm -hmm. maybe in some situation complicated, maybe uh, positive, but most of them I think is uh, negative. Um, almost most of the time, right? Yes. Okay, most of the time. Okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> oh. Why? Why do you Over, think it's positive, Miss Zhang? Um, for example, one, uh, it, I mean that when we talk about an, uh, a, a new phone or a new or a new equipment, is uh, it uh, complicate, it compli complicated because it uh, had a lot of item that had a lot of uh, uh, useful. Uh, I mean that, that, that so so it's complicated, but it's uh, effective. So it's uh, positive. <laughs> yeah, and that's right. Okay, so you can see it as a negative and a positive. Okay, yeah. very good. Like uh, like for example, being a dentist, right? Being a dentist a is complex job. or yeah. complicated. But if you finish it, okay, if you finish studying, it will be very yeah. um, successful, right? Yes. Okay. So uh, what about uh, costly? Why do you think it's positive, costly or expensive? Uh, I mean that it's um, expensive is, yeah. Mo like you say, most of the time is negative. Uh, when we buy something, is expensive. We don't like it. It's negative. But costly, is, I mean that something costly is something is value. Uh, okay. Ah, oh, valuable. Yes, it's valuable. Yes. Can you give me some examples? Or what are these that things? Yeah, maybe uh, in comparing between two phones, the remote is iPhone or uh, another type. Uh -huh. So iPhone is expensive, but it's costly with the money that we pay for them to get the uh, the phone. That's right. It's 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 worth it, right? It yeah. is worth it. So. Uh, even if it's expensive, okay, yeah, it's quality, right? It yeah. has a good quality. Okay, like it's expensive or costly, okay, yeah. but it's very um worth it, okay? Yes. Okay, so. What about number 11, overconfident? Okay, why do you think yes. it's negative, Ms. Yes, it's negative. It's, confident is good. When you're confident, to, uh, you can uh, do uh, some, to, you can do the thing is more successful. But maybe um, it's good in something, but overconfident is not good because uh, you, uh, when when someone someone is overconfident is that they they believe they have a strong belief in themselves so maybe they cannot they, they can cannot give um, um, respect for others and uh, it's hard to connect with other or it's hard to make friends with other if they are overconfident people I think that so it's negative. <laughs> That is correct. So being confident is good, right? Being confident is yes. good because you yes. don't feel shy. 
right? You try, but that's really good. Okay, other people be humble. Yes. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. So I, thank you so much, Ms. Zhang. We have finished number one. Okay. Number two. Yeah. So using as many at uh, using okay as many of the adjectives as possible. Discuss yeah. what makes an effective website in your culture. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can you tell me? Yeah. You can choose answers from from the words that we have learned. Yeah. This what make an effective website in your culture? Yes. Mm -hmm. Like in Vietnam, okay. What yes. are the adjectives that made the website very effective in Vietnam? In the ones that we learned on the seven, the number seven. Uh -huh. I think maybe reliable, positive, effective. Watchers. Okay, that is true. Yeah. So we have effective. Okay. Yeah. Oh, what about um, being um, simple? Okay. Do you like um, a simple, simple website in Vietnam? Yes, I think it's, it's good because it's easy to use, easy to connect every people, easy to, to find them. It's good. Simple. That's right. Okay. Yeah. What about um complicated? Okay. Do you like complicated, complicated website? No. <laughs> no. People will find it difficult, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. So what? Okay. Because your hospital or your clinic has a website. Can you describe how does it look? I, um, to be honest, I'm not come to. I'm not. I. 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 I am not often. I often go to their website to check or to see, but uh, I think it's uh, in um in the level one to say one to ten, it's maybe in uh, five or six max. Ah, so it's it's not bad, right? Okay, yeah. five to six is not bad, but you're not visiting your website. Hmm. <laughs> Do you visit your website all the time? Um, I don't. It's maybe it's a, maybe one or two a, a week, one or twice a week, maybe. Uh, it's rarely, right? Rarely. Really? I'm sorry. I, I need to uh, to give uh, my uh, MacBook on chat in chat. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'll wait for you, Miss Zhang. Okay. I finish it now. That? Oh, okay. okay. All right. So you know what? Okay. In my company, because I am also working in a company, we also have a website. Okay, but we always need to visit it. We need to post every time, okay? Because the students will check on our website. Okay, so we need to post um, students, okay? We need to post about teachers and about yeah. the company so that yeah. they will enroll, okay? They will enroll in our company. Oh, how about you, um, Miss? How did you find Halo? How did you know Hello. it? Yes, uh, um, I just uh, when I suffering my Facebook, I see uh, advertising and I said Taiwanese, and they contact me. <laughs> ah, yeah. yeah. So it's and your but, uh, it's your first time too. Is it your first time? Yes. I'm uh, wow, okay. an easy. So I'm an easy customer. <laughs> Yes. 
That's right. I thought I thought you've been here for a long time. I'm sorry for Okay, I'm sorry. I I need one minute. Sorry teacher. Uh, okay, I'm uh, sorry, teacher. Okay, I'm finished now. Uh, yeah, all right. Okay, so um, well, you're friends okay do you have friends are studying in hollow too no i mean Sam, do you have friends who are studying in hollow oh you don't know no yes i don't have any friend who or oh, maybe I, my friend i'll ask learning on hollow but i don't know that like i said to you before yeah. i i don't have i i'm, I'm not contact or not type with my or send miss messengers with my friend in uh, university not uh, not so often so maybe i i miss this uh -huh. information yes uh, from them yes um, yeah um, oh that would be yeah. wonderful okay yeah. <laughs> all right uh, so if like they you, wanted uh, to learn yeah I'm not use uh, Facebook or Instagram too much on today. I did use it maybe 30 to one hours. And, uh, and my job in, in our company, they have a customer service staff. They will check information about the patient or the customer or who care about these, these services. Now, um, I'm a dentist, oh. I just need to care about the patient when they come here or fix their problem and uh, i don't need time yeah need so to go to the uh, it, it, website yes it's that's okay. right and it's not your job Sorry, teacher. Is the, maybe the connect, the internet connection is not good oh. today. <laughs> oh yeah, okay, yeah. Because I wait, I will move to to the second floor. I know that, okay. That I I, I see. <laughs> I'm so sorry, that because I went to my hometown today. Yes, oh, your home looks. So yeah, I, I went to my hometown, so, so it's quite. Yes. <sighs> can you hear me now? Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, I can hear you. Oh, is it strong now? Yes. Okay. Hello, Ms. Zhang. Can you hear me? Okay, I can hear you. Okay. So I'm so sorry. Uh, yeah. Tomorrow, don't I? No, no, next meeting. Okay, yeah. I will be back in the office. Okay, it's just for today because I need yeah. to do something here. Yes, don't worry. Okay, Miss Zhang, please read number three. Yeah, thank you so much. Yeah. Oh, please read number three, Miss Zhang. Once a pack, what well, a pass of a website would give a negative first impressions. Oh. Okay, so what is your answer? What aspects of a website would give a negative first impression? So if you are, for example, you are looking on a website, what yes. are the things okay, that made you um, hate it or you don't like it in the beginning? Um, I think it depends on the uh, personality of the visitor. So maybe the picture or the logo or anything from the website but they don't like it but for me I it hard for me to give a negative or uh, uh, like uh, uh, when the first in, in the first impression I don't give any decision or any opinion for someone or something when the first time 
I tried to learn it. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So it's very important to um to yeah. prepare or to make a beautiful website also. Okay. Yeah. Right. Okay, so now we have the uh, number nine. Okay, yeah. Ms. Yang, number nine. Okay, yeah. we'll work with a teacher. Okay, for example, I'm your partner. Look at these yeah. things which can create a good or bad first impression of a company. Okay, yeah. so you will tell me, okay, like uh, what about uniform? Okay, does it yeah. give a good or bad impression in a company? Yeah. I think that uh, it depends on, like like I said before, it like I told before, because it depends on the people. But I think that uniform will you create can create a good impression of for company. Um, for the first time, people come and see uh, the staff where uniform is where beautiful or where good uniform. They will have a a better, uh, uh -huh. a, a bad, uh, just a good looking thing uh, that it can yes. create a good impression. Yeah. Um, okay, so it depends in a company again. Okay? So if that yeah. company needs a uniform, of course yeah. they need to use a uniform, right? But yes. there are also company, okay, there are company who doesn't wear uniform. They wear um casual. Yes. Are you familiar with casual, Miss uh, Zhang? Okay, yes. like this one. Uh, they have casual. Yes, casual, casual attire. Casual attire. I know uh, casual. Okay. Yes. Okay, so even if you don't have uniform, okay, you yes. need to wear casual attire to look yes. professional. Yeah, it's but I think that is for for customer or for. They like uniform, but not oh, more. Not I cannot of hear this. you, Ms. Zhang. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, I can hear you now. I'll wait for a moment, okay? Yes. Can you hear me? Hello? Oh, can you hear me? Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, so what what are you saying a while ago? Uh, I say that the uniform may be... Um, uh, can create a good impression for customer because uh, maybe there are so many uh, employers who want to wear the thing that they want to wear when you go to work. Mm -hmm. They don't like uniform. <laughs> oh, you don't like uniform? Why? <laughs> but no, 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 know, no, not for me. I like not the uniform. For me. No, not ah. for me. I, not for me because. Uh, as a doctor, as a authentic or nurse, we have to wear uniform when we go to the hospital. It's good. I I mean that uh, uh, with another type of company, I have so many friends that say they they told that they say that they don't want to wear uniform because they want to wear look more beautiful with their dress or they want uh -huh. to wear they want to wear the thing that they want. Oh yes. yes. Okay. Me we don't too. want to have Me the too. same way. Yes. Okay. So for example, in my company, we don't have a uniform. Okay, we only wear uniform every Monday. Uh, Monday. And then after good. Monday. Yeah. yeah, after Monday you can wear um casual attire, but you need to look yes. formal. The formal. I, I know that. Okay. Is, uh, so you can uh, you can wear the thing that you want to wear. It make you more beautiful or more comfortable. It's good. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. Oh, what about when you were a student? Okay, when you were yes. a student, Miss Zhang, do you wear a uniform? Yes. Um, we just need to wear uniform on a special occasion. Um. Uh, most of the time, we we don't need to wear uniform. But when we go to the when we go to the hospital or to uh, to practice, we have a two mm -hmm. way uh, blouse. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. And what about you, Miss Zhang? When you were a child, when you were a child, what kind of uniform or what kind of job do you like? Yes, I don't remember exactly the time, 
when I go to school when I was young. I don't uh -huh. know. Suddenly, I, 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 I like or um, dislike uh, the uniform, but I think it, it good. Uniform is good for student uh, because um, That's um, because uh, if the person is, I mean that uh, it uh, it can uh, close the gap between the rich family and poor family, and the student had the same the same uniform. It's, mm -hmm. it's equal. I think that it's good. It's good to wear uniform. It's That's school. right. Yeah. Yes, and you will know. Okay, you will know which school they are from. Okay. Yeah. For example, in Montessori. Yeah. Okay, in Montessori yeah. they wear a uniform, so you will know that. Oh, that child is from Montessori. Oh, that child yeah. is from this one. Right. Yes. Okay. And also in a company. Okay. So if you yes. saw someone wearing a uniform, you will know which company yes. they are working in. It's like a also, uh, yeah, like the ID, okay? ID, they also yes. wear an ID, okay? Yes. Yeah. All right, next one, Ms. Zhang. Office, okay, office or business okay. premises. Uh, can you tell me the meaning of business premises? Oh, when we say business premises, um, these are the rule in the office or in the company or the oh commodity wait wait i will yeah. send you this one okay here business um premises or yeah. like um commo commodities uh, i think it is one right yeah um the place, the place, the office, it had the same mm -hmm. meaning with the office. Yes, it's, it's the environment. It yes, it's yes, the environment. Uh, so is it a good or bad impression? It's, it's, if we do it well, it will a good, it will, it can create a good impressions. Okay, like for example, yeah. Ms. Lang, um, I want to work in that company because it's very big. Right? Yes. <laughs> so it's a good impression also. Like people don't want to work in a company if it's um too hot, if it's too small, right? And if it's not complete, right? Yeah. The things yeah. are not complete. Okay. <laughs> so this is a good impression also. What about telephone yeah. answering system? Yeah, um, is it really important when the first time you come to a company and you hear this, the, the voice of uh, a telephone answering uh, okay. answer, answer and they uh, they gentle and they polite, polite, polite. Mm -hmm. Yeah, polite. Polite. And it's, uh, we call that voicemail, right? Voicemail. A voicemail. Okay, voicemail. Or okay. telephone, um, like telephone. Uh, the HR, right? HR. It's a human, human uh, resources. Resources, human resources. Okay. So sometimes, okay, if you don't want to go to the office, if you are a customer, okay, if you... Okay, so if you don't want to go to the office, Miss Zan, you need to uh, uh, call, right? Like you, you yeah. wanted to make an appointment, okay? But if they are not polite, you will have yes. a bad impression in that company. Yeah. So how about in your clinic, Miss Zan? How about in your clinic? Uh, do you have polite people who are answering the, uh, who are answering the telephone or the phone call? Yes. Yes. Uh, they have a um, strict uh, standard, a harsh standard for the person who get this position. Uh, they mm -hmm. train them before they give the give the phone. To the them. job. Yes. yes. That's why training is very important. Okay. Yes. Okay. What about number uh, four? What is this? Reception area. I think 
and then when the first time we come to a place, you see a beautiful, uh, um, a good orange, um, mm -hmm. uh, a, a reception, and the receptor is uh, had a uh, is polite and it's beautiful or uh, uh, is kind. This can mm -hmm. create a uh, good impressions. For That's right. Yeah. Especially if it's comfortable, okay. Yeah. <laughs> if the customers are comfortable, okay, yeah. they will love your reception area, or they will love the company also. Yeah. Okay. So what about you, Miss Zhang? Do you also have a reception area? Yes, we have. Okay. In each so department, in each, department? Yeah, each department, we have one reception area. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, and. Your patients will wait in the reception area. Yes. Yeah. They wait. They sit here and wait for your turn, for their turns. Yeah. And yes. That's right. OK. All right. So now, Ms. Zhang, we also have here meeting or conference rooms. Do you have this yes. in your clinic? Meeting or conference yes. rooms? Yes. We have one big meeting room for on staff and maybe three meetings room for um, um, managers. Uh -huh. And I yeah, uh -huh. but I think that it it can uh, create it can create a good impression for the staff when the first time they come here to get a an interviewer interview or job. Mm -hmm. Um yes. Yes, okay. So we need a complete package right you <laughs> we need a reception area okay conference rooms okay yeah. if your company is a big company right but yeah. okay in my company <laughs> okay it's still yeah. it's a small company so we yeah. only have oh in in my country okay because hello english in is in vietnam okay yeah hello english office is in vietnam but yes okay wow. i not in Vietnam, okay? Yeah. <laughs> so we also have an office here, but it's not very big. We have yeah. um like 20, 25 teachers. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. So now we sang, okay. We will continue this again on Monday. Right? Okay. We will have class on Monday again. So tomorrow is out. Yeah. Our yeah. free time. Okay. <laughs> so what will yes. you do tomorrow, Miss Sang? Oh, tomorrow I have to go to work. Mm, yeah, yeah, your day off is finished, right? Yes. <laughs> okay. So I'll see you tomorrow, Ms. Zhang, and thank you so much for having you to now uh, to pay and enjoy yes. your your rest day. Yes. Okay. Goodbye. Thank you, Dita. Goodbye. Okay. Yeah. I cannot end.